Ankylosing spondylitis. Ankylosing spondylitis is an inflammatory systemic disorder that affects primarily the axial skeleton and peripheral joints in young men. Etiology. Three times more common in men than women. Usually starts by decade two or three of life. 90% of patients are positive for HLA-B27. More common among first-degree relatives of patients with ankylosing spondylitis. Clinical presentation. Sacroiliitis is usually the earliest finding. Chronic lower back pain. Morning stiffness that improves with exercise. Reduced spine mobility. Anterior uveitis, aortic insufficiency, heart block, Achilles and patella tendonitis, reduced chest expansion, pulmonary fibrosis. Classification Axial ankylosing spondylitis, non radiographic ankylosing spondylitis. Peripheral ankylosing spondylitis. Diagnosis. History taking. Diagnostic radiology including X-ray and MRI showing. Symmetric subchondral erosions then sclerosis, narrowing and eventually fusion in the sacroiliac joints. Lumbar vertebral squaring. Sclerosis. Ligamentous calcification, syndesmophytes, followed by charismatic bamboo spine, CBC, ESR, and CRP. HLA-B27 is not commonly used as a diagnostic test. Treatment NSAIDs is the first line of treatment. Physical therapy and exercise. Sulfasalazine, methotrexate, tumor necrosis factor alpha inhibitors, etanercept, infliximab, adalimumab, interleukin-17 antagonists, surgical options if the disease is progressive. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please click like and subscribe to our channel.